I was literally in the midst of- Oh! Ooh, I tried to bubble in time, man! What is up there, guys? This is Corbin. What the fuck are my buttons again? Oh, man. First game of the day on Corby Cow. Haven't played Corby Cow in- Well, fuck it, since the last video. <laughs> Let's see if we've still got what it takes, man. She's the most OP badass cow in this level bracket. Oh, God, man. This can't go well. We are against a Guardian Druid, though, so that's something at least. Good. You know what, I'm just gonna hodge straight away, actually, just to get the, like, the cooldown coming back and stuff, you know? Oh, the druid's actually on me, okay. I'll just shield straight away. He just bubbled. Interesting, interesting. Come on, man, break my shield, dude. Break the shield, I dare ya. Is it gonna break? Can he even break it? Break the shield! Oh, he's so close! Oh, okay, the shield broke. I can confirm. I checked Reddit just now. And it's been confirmed on Reddit that the shield did, in fact, break. Holy fucking balls, man. No, I kicked him at the same time as that guy. Okay, just putting our dot on him. Slowing this guy. Charging in. All right, man. Sick. It looks like we did it. Looks like we did it, man. Bam. The shield broke. Oh, shit. Are we doing level 37? What's our next ability? 38, maybe? Oh my god, we actually get blessing of freedom. All right, sweet, man. Oh, no, that's another button that I've got to remember to press, man. Divine Storm, is that ever worth using? Three holy power. It's just like uh, Templar's Verdict, but an AoE, right? Okay, so it's only worth it if you're Divine Storming three or more targets. And even then, in Arena, single target is probably just better, right? When the hell did I get a crate of Battlefield goods? May contain a piece of equipment. What did I get? Oh my goodness, man. They're actually, like, a lot better than what I got as well. Sweet. Thanks for that, Blizzard. Thanks for that. What determines if you get, you know, some Battlefield goods or not? I hope you guys approve of the new transmog, by the way. Lightsaber, Cobby Cow. All right, all right. 2v1s. Ugh. Jeez, man. I nearly killed myself, man. I snapped my neck so loud. <laughs> oh my god, this poor soul. Look at him with his little hat on. He hasn't even mounted. He has no idea what he's in for, man. Should we let him win? No, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna go and murder him. It's just the way it's gotta be, okay? Oh, he's drain lifing. I don't even. This doesn't feel good, okay? It's just yeah, cataclysm. Oh my god. Oh, I should have let him win, man. I should let him win. No, because then he keep on queuing them. We taught him a harsh lesson, okay? That Paladins are OP as fuck at low level. And that Cataclysm is under no circumstances a viable talent in PvP. And opening with Drain Life is also not that good. Alright, alright, alright. Past couple of games been a little bit on the unfair side. What do we got here? Okay, we've got a decked out warrior on our team and a couple of casters. I want to go ahead and make the prediction that I could 9v1 <laughs> bunch of these guys. You never know. What's Frost like at this level, actually? I know Shadow Priest is just going to get absolutely dunked on. I mean, we're probably going to kill him in dispersion. I don't have a Hand of Freedom just yet. We get that in the next thing, so... Maybe these guys have a chance. Maybe these guys have a chance, you know. Yeah. Okay, actually... Yeah, let's go on this guy. Let's go on this guy. The slow is real. Just beaten the snot out of him. I just triggered nothing. Kick that and we won the video game. All right, so... Ugh. Ugh. Unfortunately, my shield didn't get to break in this one. Got him. <laughs> oh, Cobby Cow. Like I said in the last one, man. It's like a vacation playing this character, you know? You just kind of roll in there. You don't really know what you're doing, but it doesn't matter because you're just so OP. That you just roll over everybody anyway. I hope that you guys are still enjoying these videos. I mean, it's kind of like... Once every one in one in four videos, one in five videos. You upload some Colby Cow man and just and just crush some souls, end some careers, delete some characters. It's a good laugh for me at least anyway. I wonder if anybody else is selling their red winter clothes now. Now that the festive season is over. It's just like at you know, the local supermarkets and stuff like that. Over here it's like Asda, Tesco, that kind of stuff. Once Christmas is over, all the shit that they couldn't sell, all of the kitsch, all of the garbage that they couldn't sell during Christmas. Christmas themed chocolate stuff like that they just have like a mega sale you know no one's even selling them no one's even bothering man 
Oh my god, should I try and sell mine for like 90 copper or something? Oh, would you look at that? It's the exact same game again. Only now it's a warlock instead of a uh, shadow priest. Christ, man, these are some brave clothies, dude. All right, let's go. I'm prepared, man, I'm prepared. I think that we just go on the warlock because, as we all know, ladies and gentlemen, warlocks can't actually move. He's just already dead. I'm just gonna leave him. I'm just gonna leave him, man. There's really no uh, point anymore. Just break this mage a little bit. Drink of that snot. I didn't even touch him and he died. That's how savage we are. Alright, man, let's do like a Tesco style sale on these. When went to close. Really? No one is selling them? I still find them so hard to believe. Let's sell this for. Let's try one gold. You never know. Do you think it will sell? What do you, what do you think? Straw poll in the description. I'm just kidding. There isn't a straw poll in the description. Damn it. We were the druid. We were the balanced druid. What? Against survival writ? Oh my god, dude. Is this gonna be hard? Holy shit. Stealth. Oh, open up. Blocks. Just let them hit me first. If they hit him first and just global him, then there's no way we can win. Oh my god, dude, please. Okay. Thank fuck, man. I thought it was a safe game. This is going to be a very hard game. We're actually distinctly and unusually at a big, big disadvantage in this game. I got to go on the hunter, I think. Let's go, man. Let's get him. Let's get him. What, what do you even do to my health right there, man? Oh, the palace is AFK. Oh, they just try and like 2v1 or something. No. No. Okay, they're not going to break the... Okay, they broke the shield. I was literally in the midst of- Oh! Ooh! I tried to bubble in time, man! This red doesn't give a fuck. He was like, I'm breaking that shield, man. I don't give a- Fuck, he nearly got me killed, man. Well, at least we can, like, urge this guy now. So we won because the paladin AFK'd a little bit at the start. I don't fancy our chances if they were both at- If they were both in their final form, you know what I'm saying? If they were both actually uh, going balls to the wall. <laughs> Oh, man, I can smell that priest all the way from here, man. Smells like squid. Look at him just running, dude. He's not even... He's just like, fuck this. I'm not even trying, man. He's just out. All right, man. We'll just butcher his companion instead, you know? Shielding. Yeah, nice heal, bruh. Nice heal, bruh. Is he alive still? Well, he was. Until he had his skull stomped on. Uh, uh, and then... Uh, uh. I love that other priest in the opener. Fuck trying to get a good opener. He just ran. While in the midst of this video, actually, I want to quickly shout out a new patron as we enter this game. His name is Dog Slayer. Dog Slayer. If you come by the stream that often, or you came by the stream, you know, a bit more often in the past, especially, you probably know who Dog Slayer is. He's a champion. He's a god. He's actually a previous patron as well, you know. Dog Slayer supported, uh, support the channel, support the videos a lot over uh, the past couple of years, actually, you know. Awesome guy. Thanks a lot for that, man. Do people just play tank now at this, uh, Lola? Is this guy survival? Do we have the advantage? He's BM. Okay, fuck. This could actually be pretty close as well, then. Wait a minute. No, couldn't. We were red paladin. Ugh, let's slow this guy. I just saw the druid, but I'm just going to ignore him and savage this guy. Okay. Waiting for him to break the shield. Here it comes. The damage will be split between him and his pet. No! Are you fucking serious? Fucking get back here. Oh my god. Okay. Let's try and finish him, man. Ugh. Is he actually dead? Okay, he is actually dead. I just had to confirm there real quick. Fuck, if I'd actually used my Divine Steed a little bit better, I think I could have made it. No, it's my kill. Oh my. Oh man. The poor uh, Regents vendor. My god, man. Remember when you used to click this guy and there'd be like the candles so that you could cast the AoE paladin buffs? And um, priests would have these kind of sigils or emblems as well so they could cast, you know, the AoE buffs. Warlock infernal stones, all that kind of stuff. Now he just sells vanishing powder, man. Removes a glyph effect? How would you even apply glyphs again, man, these days? Like, I, I, I've got to be honest. They were all on about, oh, we're going to have, like, profession-based questions and all this kind of stuff, and it's going to be sick. And professions are going to have, like, real uh, value attached to them again. They're going to be part of the game again. I was like, yeah. Sweet, man. I miss the days of when, you know, 
you'd see like a max level jewel crafter or a max level tailor and you'd be like my god man I want to be as skilled as that human one day at that profession I could I mean this expansion and wood is still the expansions where I can say I just don't give a shit and snotball about professions at all. Not even a single... Like, I wouldn't even notice that they were in the game unless I accidentally misclick my K button and it brings up the profession window, you know? I would have no idea that they even existed, so... Way to go, Blizzard! <laughs> I mean, it's not the biggest deal ever, right? Professions kind of being sidelined, but... Still. God damn it, man. I tell you what, this is last game. We have faced... <laughs> What's up, Lillian from Blackrock? We've faced way too many goddamn flop comps in this episode. There have been so many, like, warlocks and mages and shadow priests and then guardian druids that just seem to do nothing. Screw you, it's now a goddamn... Oh, God, look at... It. Look! There's just no way they can ever win. Like, it's just savagery on the highest level. Ugh. God damn, man. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to leave this episode here. I'm going to go and start the live stream right about now. Not when this video is done. This video is going to be uploaded like a day or two from now, so don't head on over to the Twitch just yet unless you want to pre-follow up on that. Uh, but yeah, thanks for stopping by, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your day now. I'm going to catch all of you guys in the next episode of... What the hell do I even call these videos? Kobe Cow goes mental. There you go. The one button that I just pushed there. Not those little ones, but that, that one that I clicked just as uh just as I mentioned. 125,000? Remember when the expansion first launched? Holy shit, that thing gives 600 out of my power. That's the sickest thing I've ever seen, you know?